What's good everybody, it's your boy Hamza from Other Gaming, and today guys I'm coming to you with a brand new deck profile, or not deck profile, sorry about that guys, I don't even know why I said that, it's like test hand plus combo tutorial, whatever you guys want to call it, that's what I'm coming to you guys with, um, and this is following up with the last video, so yesterday, and like I said guys, we are back with our daily uploads, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that as well, I will be uploading like brand new content from like Battle of Legends, from Rise of the Duelist, from anything you guys want to see, so just let me know down below. Of course, before we start the video guys, make sure you guys like, comment, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe we're almost at 6,000 subscribers and we're gonna be doing a super insane giveaway so make sure you guys stay tuned for that but anyways guys check out the links down below check out the patreon but let's get straight into this video all right guys so now we're just gonna get into our first test hand so I'm gonna go solo mode and we're gonna hit that whole stool button so now we're gonna go ahead and draw our five cards and see what we can do so this is actually a pretty good hand so basically what we're gonna do is if we use fusion destiny we get locked into dark so that's the turn I'm gonna go ahead and use reinforce of the army. Rhoda is gonna go ahead and grab me probably Stratos. Yeah, we're gonna Stratos our hand like that. The graveyard. Go ahead and normal Stratos. We're gonna use Stratos' effect. And Stratos is essentially going to add us our malicious to our hand like this. And now we're going to use Ferris' effect. So now we are locked into heroes if I use this. But yeah, so it doesn't matter because we're getting locked into heroes regardless. So send this, move our boy up. Um, first effect actually, so declare first effect. First effect is gonna go ahead and grab us our increase to the spell and trap card zone, right? And then we're gonna go ahead and use increase special this guy right here. And then we're gonna use our increase effect actually to special summon our Vion. And we're gonna use, oops, I didn't mean to get that there. We're just gonna put that back at the bottom of our deck. It doesn't matter. Now we're gonna use uh, this guy effect. This guy's effect is gonna go ahead and send Shadow Mist to the graveyard. And now what I'm going to, right now what I'm thinking is, I'm thinking of if there's a possibility for me to actually be able to trigger the Shadow Mist in the graveyard. Um, like to reborn it because I really want to get the mass change, but I'm not sure if I can right now. If this card's normal summon, you can target one. I'll re normal. So, only way is to get Soul Soldier on board, but I don't think I can do that. Yeah, so we'll just use Shadow Mist effect. Doesn't matter. Shadow Mist is gonna go ahead and grab us. What do you want to get here? I guess we'll just get like a Straddles for next turn. Then we're gonna use um, this boy's effect. I'm gonna banish anything, so just banish the one that we're not gonna use. So this guy, add our poly right here. Where'd Polymer Jason go? Grab poly right here to our hand. And now, essentially, from here, what we're going to do is do I wanna go one, two, like that? Yeah, I already use this guy's effect. So we'll just go one, two, into our Cross Crusader. Okay, not special for us to turn, reveal one monster. Yeah, we'll just get this guy. Cross Crusader's effect is gonna trigger. Get Mali, add Mali, tribute Mali, fusion destiny. Um, sure during that time phase. Yeah, so we'll use his effect. Special Mali. Cross Crusader's effect again. Tribute Mali. Add another hero monster. So I'm gonna go ahead and get Absolute Zero Star Hand. Perfect. And essentially what we're going to do here is I can go Mali effect. Or should I poly? Yeah, I'll just poly away these guys. No, actually, yeah, okay. So we're gonna deck then. We're gonna deck then because I, I we're gonna try and sack to get um uh, we're gonna try and sack to get to our uh, mass change because I'm I love sacking. So get our Mali in defense because obviously you don't want to draw into Mali, and then we can poly these two away, right into our. Oh no, we can't actually. We can we only make darks, right? I think. Or. Ferris only locks us to heroes, I think. Got some heroes for us in here. Yeah, okay. So we're not locked yet. So we're gonna go Polly. And we're gonna send this guy and Stratos to the graveyard. Special summon our Sunriser. Sunriser, Sunriser, Sunriser right here. So we're gonna go chain link one uh liquid and chain link two sunriser because again we don't want to draw into micro fusion. So add this. And then draw two, and we discard one. So draw Fire Emblem Lady and Vion, and we discard one. Hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, it also doesn't matter. 
Also, you can also some hero monsters from the extra deck, or you can also some hero monsters from the extra deck for the turn. Okay, so we're just gonna send Vion to the graveyard. Um, you can special summon this card by tributing three, so special that right there, and then okay. So we're gonna special summon Firefront Lady. So now I'm, this is why Firefront Lady is actually really good as an extender, because what we're going to do here is we are going to actually uh, tribute, tribute, and tribute for our uh, plasma. And now what we are essentially going to do is use our Fusion Destiny, and Fusion Destiny is actually going to send our. Uh, Dynatag and Celestial to our graveyard to special summon um, Dystopia right here and then we're gonna go ahead and banish Dynatag and then target Dystopia so now Dystopia has a well, we're gonna put the counter on just so we know what he does and then basically I'm just trying to see if we might be able to push for more but I don't think so like obviously we can Miracle Fusion for absolute zero but we won't be able to use Liquid Soldier's effect, so there's not really a point in doing that. So I think we're just going to be fine with this, which is actually pretty good. So yeah, okay, now I'm just going to go ahead and explain what the board is. So now basically from that hand, what we netted was we essentially netted a Sunriser. So Sunriser adds as Miracle Fusion, so we have follow-up play for next turn. And on top of that, Sunriser actually provides protection, right? When attack is declared involving another hero monster, target one card on the field and destroy it. So now this already gives us um, protection with our plasma. So we have our skill drain on board. Our opponent can attack almost anything, to be honest, and we can uh, destroy it with Sunriser. On top of that, we have Dystopia, who's essentially a Dryden. Yes, he dies during the end phase, but we'll for sure get at least one pop out of this guy. So this is two pops. We got a skill drain and we got our honesty neos in our hand for next turn so say essentially for example basically what's going to happen is once going to attack we're going to use a sunriser effect pop a card and we're going to do this and we're going to pop a card and then we're going to use this and discard a card to the graveyard and then like the soapia will die but it doesn't matter because now say for example we like pass our turn right and now we draw for turn and now we so that's actually pretty good so now you have shadow mist and we still have miracle fusion and now essentially what i was saying is since we're not locked into heroes now we can go into like a cute little cross sheep play where like we link cards away, we miracle fusion cross sheep, cross sheep will like reborn another card and then we link again into another monster. So it is really good in what that provides. But yeah, so that's it for one test hand guys. Now let's get into another test hand really, really quickly. So now guys, we are just going to get into the other test hand. And again guys, I know I can plus press reset deck, but I just left just to show you guys um, because my computer does get a little laggy. But yeah, so right here, shout again and boom, this hand is actually re very, very good. Um, yeah, actually this hand's kind of insane. So we can go normal Stratos, get that, get that. Um, Stratos, we'll get that. Fire Friendly, we'll get that. Normal Stratos, add Mali, Mali that. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna go ahead and go Stratos, Stratos is effect. So again, we are going to be doing something very similar, um, in the previous, where is we're gonna add this guy to our hand. And now we're gonna go ahead and special summon our Fire Friendly Lady in defense position. And then we're gonna go ahead and use our effect actually to tribute, which is really cool, and to special summon our Vion. And now Vion's effect is gonna trigger. So now you guys can see why Fire Friend Lady is like so insane. You actually can't imprint this, which is actually pretty funny as well. Um, but yeah, so this effect is gonna trigger. We're gonna send Shadow Mist to the graveyard. Why did I add this to my hand? We're gonna send Shadow Mist to the graveyard, and we're gonna trigger Shadow Mist's effect in the graveyard. And Shadow Mist is actually going to go ahead and add us. Doesn't matter because this is gonna link into another card, get us that. And we're gonna get that with Vion, so we can get him to our hand. And we still have Ferris Place as well, so we're gonna have a lot of monsters on board. We can get Plasma with this, and then Cross Crusaders can add us to that. So yeah, we're gonna get Plasma to our hand here, and then we're gonna go ahead and use Ferris effect. So special Ferris, pitch Mali. We're gonna go ahead and use Ferris effect. Ferris effect is gonna trigger. Get our increase. Oh, sorry. I, I, for some reason, I think Absolute or whatever Waterboy's name is to this. Use his effect. Tribute Ferris to the graveyard. Move him. Now we're going to use his effect um, to get our Vion again. It doesn't really matter, even though we've already had a Vion. Um, yeah, it doesn't really matter. I was just trying to see if we had like another cute play, but it, it's fine. We're going to go ahead and use uh, Vion's second effect to banish to add our poly to our hand. So we're gonna get poly right here. So, yeah, my poly. Cool, cool, cool. And then right here we have two darks, so we're gonna turn these guys away into our Cross Crusader. On summon, Cross Crusader's effect is gonna trigger. 
to get our Mali. Now that's what I was saying, like if Mali was at three, oh man, it'd be a problem. So now we're gonna go ahead and use cost status effect tribute. And this is gonna go ahead and add our uh, liquid soldier to our hand, or do I wanna get our honest Neos? Because we have plasma play already. Um, getting the honest Neos would be nice, but I feel like it's not necessary. Probably to our hand. Yeah, whatever, we'll just add this to our hand. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to use uh, Polymerization and send this guy to the graveyard. And do I want Vion? Yeah, I want Vion. Okay, we'll yeah, so we'll get this, these two. Two special summon our Sunriser. And again, it's going to be uh, Liquid Boy 1, Sunriser 2, because we don't want to draw into Miracle Fusion. Grab Miracle Fusion to our hand right here, and then Shuffle. And then we're going to go ahead and draw two and discard one. And we drew an Ash, which is pretty good. Um, so we're going to pitch this. And yeah, so now what we're going to do is use Miracle Fusion to banish Liquid. And does it really matter? No, we have to banish an Elemental Hero, I'm pretty sure. So banish that. Special Summon our Absolute Zero right here. Then use Mali Effect. Oh, let me get this guy off the board though, real quick. Then banish Mali. Special Mali this Malian defense and then of course if you have plasma we're going to tribute three special plasma right here and then we got a mass change and yeah obviously if three Malis was here we'd be it'd be pretty good but yeah so essentially now what we ended with is we ended with the absolute zero acid uh wombo combo right where you do like the absolute zero chain like one acid chain like two and then on top of that we also ended with the sunrise to protect and then we still ended with the skill drain but if you wanted to do a different route again you guys can and basically what the different route would be is this card would go back to the extra deck and we would actually keep um the vion instead oh wait not the extra deck, sorry this card would be uh in the graveyard and we keep the vion instead because now we can mass change the vion into a dark law so basically we would have a plasma right here basically we have a plasma a Dark Claw and a Sunriser, but going blind game one, it's probably better to do the Absolute Zero Asset play, especially if you're dueling against decks like Eldritch and stuff like that, um, because you can like Heavy Storm their back row, and Sunriser does give you a lot of layers of protection. Then on top of that, we do the Ash Blossom, so it is really good um, in that regard as well. But yeah, guys, so that was it for my test sand video. If you guys want to see more videos, make sure you guys comment down below. Like I said, we are going to be doing daily uploads. So again, if you guys have any other decks you guys want to see, any test hands, any combos you guys need to know, make sure you guys let me know down below as well. And that would be super awesome. But again, guys, this is Hamza. And like I always say, keep on shining and never give up on your dreams. Peace.